guys, it's Lexi. Today I'm going to be doing um, a tip, a tip for makeup removal. Um, before I get on that, I just want to say um, <clears throat> make sure to check out my blog and my Facebook page. Um, my blog, I'm going to, which is simplebraidedhairstyles.com, by the way, I'm going to be posting tips, um, daily tips that I find are helpful. Anything from storage for your makeup and hair stuff to tips about your face, um, hair tips, everything. And Facebook is where I'll post videos that I do like this or things that I just write on my blog. Um, so that's going to be kind of some place you guys are really going to want to check out. And the other thing is um, that today I'm going to be doing a tip. I don't know, I have something else to say, but I kind of forgot. So today's tip is using baby washcloths. Um, they look like this, and they're so tiny and cute, and they're so soft. What happens is, is when you're using a regular towel, like the towel you dry your hair with after a shower, it creates premature wrinkles throughout the eye area. And if you're really rubbing hard, well, not with this towel, but with a rough towel, it's creating the skin to create wrinkles. And if you're like me and you have contacts, you have to pull your eye down. That's also creating premature wrinkles. So preventing those wrinkles by one step by using a towel that's softer for your face is really, really going to help. Um, so you can get these at Kmart, Walmart, Target, any of those big stores in the baby department. Um, and they look like this and they're really, really soft. Um, I would buy four or five of these and um, just to use them for your face to prevent those um, premature wrinkles. You might not be thinking about it now, but when you're 40 and you're wondering why you have these little really bad deep wrinkles here, it's going to be because of this, because of pulling on your eyes when you're doing makeup. Um, so yeah, just make sure you're kind of cautious about that when um, you're taking off your makeup. And the other thing is that, I still forgot what I was going to say. Well, I guess that's it for, um, it's going to wrap it up for this tutorial. If you like what I have on this look, um, I did a messy bun. Um, I have this tutorial, it'll be coming out. Um, and it, probably tomorrow, so keep your eyes out for this. And if you have any questions about anything that I've said in this tutorial or um, in the tutorial about my hair, um, which is under five minutes, by the way, is going, you know, you can ask me any questions. So yeah, don't forget to check out my blog, simplebraidedhairstyles.com and my Facebook page. I'll talk to you later.